Private Henry Mayer was born in 1893 to William Henry and Elizabeth Alice Mayer. Henry Mayer immigrated from Stockport to Mortdale, New South Wales in Australia in 1912 with his brother Joseph. He worked for the New South Wales Government Railways during this time. Henry enlisted when he was 22 years of age. Henry had a fair complexion with blue eyes and weighed 62.5 kilograms. On the 22nd of June 1915, Henry enlisted and then embarked for overseas service with the 3rd Battalion. But in Egypt, during January 1916, Henry was transferred to the newly formed 55th Battalion. The unit Henry was a part of embarked from Sydney, New South Wales on board the HMAT A8 Argyllshire on the 30th of September 1915. They disembarked in Egypt in late October and endured a training camp at Tel Aviv. The battalion embarked at Alexandria on the 19th of June 1916 on board the HG Caledonian for Mazai and disembarked at Mazai on the 29th of June 1916. Arriving in France on the 30th of June 1916, the battalion entered the frontline trenches for the first time on the 12th of July and fought its first major battle at Fromelles a week later. During the Fromelles battle, Henry was in the Lewis gun section, a line of men firing machine guns at the German trenches. Henry was holding the trench acquired by the Australian soldiers from the Germans on his last night. Lewis guns can take casualties very quickly and consequently were a good defence weapon against advancing enemy infantry. Fellow soldiers were instructed to attack strongly fortified German frontline positions near the Orbers Ridge. The attack was intended as a feint to hold and diverge German reserves from advancing south to Somme, where a large Allied offensive had begun on the 1st of July. The feint was a disastrous failure, which ultimately resulted in mass casualties. Australian and British soldiers assaulted in broad daylight and under the direct observation and heavy fire from the German line, which has caused the disastrous failure of the feint. Henry May was shot in the head and killed instantly during the night of July 19, 1916. He was 23 years old. He belonged to the MGS Don Duignon 4799. A fellow soldier stated, He was shot through the head. I saw his dead body. A witness made a comment explaining the saddening events that occurred leading to Henry Mayer's passing. Private Henry Mayer was killed in firing a machine gun over my shoulder, he said. It was the German third line at midnight on 19th of July. He was killed instantaneously and could not have suffered any pain. He was a quiet boy, but a fighter, one of my best lads.